um, Comic Con, I don't know. I mean, there was stuff going on, but it didn't seem too interesting. I'm out here on the train tracks in Newark waiting to take a train to Penn Station. Uh, I got shit on my sensor. Hold up. All right, so that's better. So like I was saying, we are headed to Penn Station with two bags. This is kind of a pain, honestly. These are uh, from one train to another train, and then I gotta get on the subway after this from Penn Station to Brooklyn. Then we'll be at the rehearsal spot. And then tonight we take off on the bus to start the first show is tomorrow in Virginia. Right into things. Um, Dunkin' Donuts, everything bagel with cream cheese. We're keeping it real. Hotel Stamford, New York, 43 West 32nd Street. You could probably walk here from here. Hold on. 43 West 32nd. Oh, yeah. Eight minute walk. So, literally, you come up out of here and you go up one block. Hey, have you been to New York before? No. The street's just numbers, man. 41, 42, 40. You would just follow either up or if you start going the wrong way, turn around and go the other way. But no problem. Damn, I have no idea where I'm going, though, is the problem. We need to find the subway and get to Brooklyn. So, check in when we get to the rehearsal spot. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Uh, so it's crazy down here in this subway. I don't mind if you see that you go in the way. I just don't wanna be lonely. So we're in Brooklyn. I'm at the rehearsal spot. I've had a few cocktails, smoked some weed. Beautiful out here. I don't know what this looks like to you guys, but uh, very nice. Brooklyn is awesome. This rehearsal space is awesome. This is where we get to chill. And then, no, I'm not live. I'm just, I'm just doing a little vlogging because, oh shit. And then here's the rehearsal spot. We're going to the roof. So here's the hangout spot. It's beautiful. Really nice out here. Really awesome. Yeah, it's the golden hour. We're in Brooklyn. I'm a little drunk. Probably gonna get dinner soon. I gotta finish this work. Got a lot to do. But uh, probably shouldn't have got so lit. Oh shit, look at that airplane. Yeah, I don't know the last time I've checked in. It's been quite a while. But we are here backstage in Charlottesville, Virginia. It's a little hard to see. This is my path to the front of the house. There's a tunnel here that I found. And the tunnel can get me to the front where all the people are. I can also smoke weed in this tunnel. Growth along the ground of the tunnel there's it's a wild fern plant here it's also some sort of feeder i don't know what kind of animals were feeding down here or is that just a rat poison feeder i don't know but welcome to virginia folks this is where we are We've got a show it's a sold out theater upstairs actually looks much nicer than it is down here we're gonna come through the door and into the world let's see what's on the other side bar they come out here green rooms, there is an unbelievable amount of dicks drawn on the walls. And there's some very, very creative dicks drawn on the walls. So we're gonna take a dick tour. <laughs> what are these feeders for down here? Another feeder. I wouldn't want to eat out of that. So as we come back into the green room here, it's my setup, my desk, got everything I need right here. Radios, whoa. Start with this guy. if we can use these. Now, some classic ones in here. And then there's this one. Now, speaking of hurricanes, Teddy is right now in a typhoon in Japan. I've heard from him, so we know he's okay. Um, pretty scary stuff. 1958, 1,200 people died in a similar typhoon. At least that's what my mother told me this morning. My mother's called me about Teddy. Teddy's mother's called me about Teddy. Probably not supposed to tell him that. I think that's what I told her. Looks like this music's gonna start. It's gonna be hard. We'll leave you with this one. Here I am in Virginia. Nope, Tennessee. I am in Chattanooga, Tennessee, which borders Georgia and also is very close to Alabama. We're an hour from the festival that we need to play tomorrow, and it's an off day. So I've been slacking on the vlogging. I, not really. I See, you know, this is a hard battle I have. Sometimes I feel like I'm slacking, but sometimes I also feel like there's nothing much to show you guys. Try and show some cool stuff. I mean, I'm in a Hilton right now. Not too much uh, going on, but I think I'm going to take this camera and just take a journey. All my friends are doing their own things. I had some laundry to do. I think I'm just gonna take a solo day, go out, have some lunch, car show up the road. I'm not really into cars, but maybe we'll go check it out. We're gonna see what Chattanooga, Tennessee is all about. God damn it, I got this joint roll. This is the hardest part, is finding somewhere to smoke in some of these areas. It's very populated, it's the south, they're not as cool with trees. Sometimes our bus parks somewhere totally on the low and you can just sit behind it. Today, as proud our bus driver is of being able to park right outside of the hotel so we can go door to door, 
which is awesome for some people. I, on the other hand, have nowhere to smoke. So we're gonna venture out, I'm gonna find somewhere to hit this clip, and then, um, yeah, then we're gonna hit up the town and see what's up. You guys are coming with me, and this is it. This is vlogging in Chattanooga. Nice little pool out here. We got a blue bus this time, which is really nice, because each time these buses are all a little bit different. Ironically enough, like Teddy, the bus is from North Carolina. Seems like everything inside is Carolina blue. I don't know if that's on purpose or not. Nice little back lounge here. The PlayStation 2. PlayStation 4 as well. Not the 2, I'm saying 2 like we also have it. Here's my mom. Another PlayStation up here. Unfortunately, the internet is never good enough to play for. Teddy says I narrate what I'm doing a lot for no reason, which makes sense because I feel myself doing it. So I'm going to try and not narrate what we're doing and just show it to you. Also, the name of the bus is True Believer. I don't know if it's a religious thing or if it's like a we believe in aliens type of thing. I really can't tell. All right. Off we go on our adventure. Not that I'm narrating, I'm just... I don't know, this little uh, dumpster alley area may be it. This, this may be as, as on the low as you get out here, so this could be the spot. Spark it up and go from here. This is my only option, really. I was thinking of going to the top of the parking garage, but it seems a bit excessive. I think we're pretty good out here. We'll hope so. Back in the building. Oh, blazed as hell. I will bring these two beers. Let's get this Saturday kicking off right. You know what I mean? We're on vacation here. Drop just went down. Actually, I'm waiting on a call from Teddy. Wanted to make sure that he's alive in this typhoon. Typhoon Teddy. I'm surprised he hasn't changed his name to that yet on Twitter. You know, at least we know that I created the name. If we see it, hopefully this makes the vlog because I think that's important. Important that my creativity with the name. Oh shit, my man got the sweet it's looking like. I just wanted to get you saying hi. We got LJ, the best <laughs> tour guide in any city, and we are headed out to Chattanooga, Tennessee. LJ, what kind of suggestions do you have? It's oh. weird for me to talk. LJ, off camera, just put me on to a barbecue spot. Oh, yeah. We're going to the car show. We're at the car show. You have to pay for it. I don't care about cars at all. We're skipping the car show. The pinball museum, which way is that? Can we play there? We need what? some footage of the beautiful streets. Chattanooga. We're going to the pinball museum. No way. Oh, a little bubble tea? I'm gonna be drinking plenty of that once I get to Japan. No quarters needed, unlimited free play. Which is great, but do I really and wanna play? Appear. We're skipping this event too. I'm not gonna play $15 worth of pinball as cool as this place looks. I don't know. Where are we going? Let's do it. I don't know. I'm always nervous to axe throw. We can get some tacos. Can't take that thing out. Sorry. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, I got Mine bed's under. Mine. I knew this could happen. <laughs> it is, that's what I'm saying, the bottom of the... Oh god, well the phone's waterproof now. That's the plus here. Now I gotta wash this hoodie. This was my only hoodie. Okay. It's like we're about It's like Everybody's so packed. There's a car show, there's a tow truck show, and a Volkswagen car show. <laughs> the streets are just overrun with people, so we've we've headed a little out of town over in the aquarium section. Yeah. Something big coming out. That's cool. Like the boat on the Yeah. Real. What is this called? Cheers. <laughs> Chattanooga Duck Tours! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I keep seeing these everywhere and I haven't tried them, so I just had to cop. Oh, What's up, dude? <laughs> nice to see you. Good to see you, man. Yeah, sorry, wrong exit. Oh, no. You like it? Yeah. Oh, cool. Have you four? Oh, yeah, all the time. Oh, really? Eat once a week. Oh, really? Yeah.
Because like usually American guys don't like tongue. Yeah, but I'm from the south. <laughs> I used to come home from yeah, school. Yeah, yeah. I used to come home from school, ribs and, and my dad would have a, a whole tongue yeah. in the crock pot, in the crock pot, and he just open it and he'd be like, and... you know, how has it got some stomach? Uh huh. <laughs> And I think part, one part of stomach. Crazy. We roll, cook it? Roll. We cook it or we eat it raw? No, we eat roll. No, shut up. Really? <laughs> yeah. That's my grandpa favorite. Oh my so god, that's so that crazy. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, I'm gonna give it a shot. Maybe one, one piece. Yeah, I'll go small. <laughs> oh man. I wish Ern was here right now because I could just make him do it. <laughs> it's just really tough. <laughs> like really tough. <laughs> it's like an octopus. Yeah, but not. I'll just tell myself it is. It'll make it easier. <laughs> or a squid or something. Shout out to Grandpa. I'm not gonna eat anymore of that one. <laughs> <laughs> that one's crazy. Ugh. You gotta try it though. I sort of learned you gotta try it. So this scalp inside. Oh yeah, that's just. But the outside is like uh, like actual scalp. Yeah, the scallop part. And, and, and whole thing. Scalp like maybe you see the middle one. Yeah. Without. Are we eating the whole thing? Yes. Ooh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Set me up. <laughs> what is the orange part? I think guts. Huh. Guts. It's like a like like a. Like a egg, like a yellow part of an egg. <laughs> the yolk. Yolk. <laughs> the scallop yolk. Yeah. <laughs> it's the craziest scallop I've ever seen in my life. I see like the normal American scallop right there. That's what we eat. Mm -hmm. That part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're saying I need to try this part. Because like a scallop, like a... The... It's, it's a like, little fishy. But... Like a fish shake. Oh like, yeah? Like, like, like taste, like fish shake. Yeah. It's not my favorite. Get off my scallops, son. <laughs> it's sweet meat. <laughs> but real quick, tastes different. So too. much work. Get to the, there you go. Yeah. It's a good scallop. Real quick. Real quick. You think it's so funny? Well, that was fucking amazing, aside from maybe the intestines, but everything else was really, really good. Shout out to Toshi. Always bringing us to the hot spots. He said that Yukaku is trash as well, and if you want to eat there, he usually, if someone wants to eat at Yukaku, they're usually <laughs> low, low on the totem pole. He says, oh, you want to save money. Oh, this one. Awesome. For you, for you, dude. Pen steady. Color pencil. A color pencil. So it takes for fucking sorry, man. ever. I thought it was gonna be faster. Yeah, I was like, gonna no, be faster. No. Prism of color? Yeah. No, it took, takes forever. <laughs> it took forever. Oh, maybe, I don't know. You should bring it back. Nah, it's whatever. I, 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 I give you. I don't need it, it's okay. Please. You're crazy. Here, let me roll it up. Free doing all the shit you gotta do but uh we picked these up yesterday and i didn't eat them dog they're like straight up french fries straight up like if you ever when you go to get fries and you get that one two like extra crispy fry it's just like super crisp out that's basically essentially that is what we got super crispy fry so it's kind of like a potato chip they're expensive too, they're $4. Apparently a high quality potato. Uh, last night was mad real. My stomach hurt this morning. I don't know if that's because I ate stomach, but my stomach. Shout out to Toshi. <clears throat> Always love hanging out with Tosh. He's one of my favorite people on this fucking planet. I also think I'm gonna end up spending Halloween in Osaka. I don't think I'm gonna do it here. Cause I think there's a lot of, I'm really just like not into 
Shibuya, Shinjuku, and Harajuku that much anymore. Like, it's really cool when you come to Japan to check those neighborhoods out, and it's like kind of like essential, right? Like, you have to check them out. But the more time you spend here, I'm gonna sound like a total, I'm gonna sound like a total fucking elitist, but the more time you spend here, the more you don't wanna, it just, all that shit, it's not that it's touristy, it's just that it's so dense, and you can really get like the essence of Japan, not or even the essence of Tokyo, not in those crazy neighborhoods. And you can even find better food outside of them. But it's not that easy to navigate if you don't know where you're going. So the first time choice to stay in, because you're in the shit. But I don't know, I'm gonna go explore new areas. Uh, heavy dragon temple vibes, dragons. We also have some of Trey's ashes and I wanna take some there and spread them. <laughs> Oh, okay. I, no, no, thank you. <laughs> uh, okay, I'll taste. Mm. With this? Mm. Black mushroom. Spicy. Good. I got the design.